National Park Service Arrowhead logo. Title, Alaska, Experience Your America. Title, Keeping Tradition. Image of curved wooden frame with wire netting wrapped around two sides as large as a car floating in the river. Text on image. Nikolai is a remote Alaskan village located in central Alaska near the Kuskokwim River. In June 2013, elders of the community came together and taught their youth how to build a fish wheel, which is a device Athabascans have used for centuries to catch fish. Caption, fish wheel at Copper Center, Alaska. Motor boat on shore of riverbank. Water glistening in the sun. Water flowing over small rocks. Five Athabascan males riding in the motor boat along river. Well, I heard, you know, a long time ago that it's going to come back to an old day, so I have to learn, learn how to survive. Title, Nick Petruska, fish wheel supervisor. So, building a fish wheel is part of the survival. Men gathering skinny tree trunks in woods. Only reason I'm doing it. <laughs> Trunks resting against each other at the top in a tall cone-like structure. Title: Nick Alexia, first chief of the Edzeno Village Council. And there was an uh, ongoing thing that we like, we'd like to teach our uh, our kids um, the traditional ways of uh, uh, the people who used to live around here. We have to keep. We try to keep. Uh, whenever we get a uh, grant, we try to keep. Uh, teach the kids the uh, traditional way that the uh, people used to live here what they used to do, how, how they used to live. And fish, fish wheel building is one, one that, uh, that the people around here use all through these years. Men using ax to score and strip bark from tree trunks. Yeah, the, the first, thing, first thing you do is they get the material, like the poles, poles for the, for the for the frame and then the log, log raft. Two men in water building raft out of logs twice as tall as a man. And the material to build a, build a raft on and then put the, put the dippers um, uh, together on, on ground and put them, put them all together and then build a raft and then put it on the raft and, 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 and get started. People building frame of the fish wheel using strip trunks and wire netting. It's easier, I mean, you don't have to get an equipment to push the raft. And if we build it in the water, you know, we don't have to have heavy equipment to move it. Wire netting is wrapped around wooden frame, nailing the wire into place. Part of the fish wheel frame consists of two rectangular sides between two triangular frames. And my generation is, my generation is gone. Then our, our language and our way of life will be... Men carry the frame to the raft. ...will be gone with us. You know, we'll have to, we want to teach them, we want to teach the kids how, how it used to be. Hammering boards to frame. Important how, how, where they come from, the identity, I guess, now. The, for them to learn for how their ancestors and how they, used to, how, they, how they used to live, how they got about to be, who they are. And I don't know, they, they should learn how to survive in this, in case something happened in, in this world, unstable world. Fish wheel sits on raft in water. Then all the fish that are caught will be given away to whoever wants it. Everybody, anybody that wants, anybody in the community wants fish, they can just give it to. It keeps uh, keep people together, friendly to each other. Men push raft with completed fish wheel into river. Title, video by Charlotte Bodick, like home performed by Keshko, used with permission. Special thanks, Nick Petruska, Nick Alexia, Beverly Gregory, Nikolai, Edzeno Village Council.